I think when I was like 18, 19, I started questioning a lot of things that I grew up believing. But I've always kind of had this idea that music should be fun and that you should be able to write about whatever you want to write about. And there's a lot of great songs about random stuff. <laughs> Hi, this is Clem from Cherry Glazer, and you are watching Talks on Indie Rocks TV. I started writing songs like when I was a kid, like five, six years old, and then I picked up the guitar when I was um, 11, and yeah, it just kind of went from there. So I've had love for making music at a really young age. We were definitely listening to a lot of Sonic Youth, and I feel like Kim, Kim is always an inspiration. And obviously, yeah, Hole is like a great band, and those are bands that I love and inspire me. And, you know, there's a lot of feminist bands that broke down a lot of doors that allow me to do what I can do. Like, I feel definitely indebted to a lot of femmes in the 90s that broke down a lot of barriers for me to, to be able to do what I do and to be respected in that way. Just the nature of a patriarchy disallows people to see what women say as uh, weighty and as like equal to what men say. So I think that um, a lot of times you can be ignored and a lot of times you can just, people don't expect much from you. Um, but I think that's just the nature of, of all things in a patriarchy. The music industry, every industry has that. So I don't think the music industry is any better or worse than really anything else. I, don't want nobody I think you have to like look inward if you want to make honest music. And um, it takes a little bit of time and it can be kind of hard because you have to get really personal with yourself. I found out like later that it was about growing up. I didn't really notice that that's what I was writing about when I was writing about it. But then when I was done, I kind of looked back at it and I was like, oh wow, <laughs> this is a lot of feelings of like growing up. I think you shouldn't really think about the public when you're making your art. I think it, it can kind of get you into a weird headspace. I love this philosophy of like, write like everyone in your life is dead, and then go back and edit as if they're alive. Basically that's all, all about just saying what you need to say regardless of, of uh, how it might make the people close in your life feel. You have to really let out your feelings because that's what being honest in your music is about. <laughs> 